Greetings, Car Fanatics. Today I'm gonna to tell you why I think the Porsche Cayenne is the best used SUV on the market, and there are seven reasons why you should buy one now. If you're a car enthusiast like me, you want an SUV that can do it all, an SUV that's highly competent on the road, yet is practical enough for all aspects of your life. For people looking into the Porsche Cayenne, the first obvious reason you would want one is performance. The first generation Cayenne is extremely powerful, especially when you go with a turbo or turbo S model. My 2008 Cayenne Turbo has a whopping 500 horsepower and 516 foot-pounds of torque. So even though this Cayenne weighs over 5,000 pounds, it can really move. In addition, Porsche doesn't make compromises compared to more mainstay automakers. My Cayenne comes with powerful six-piston caliper brakes up front with 14.5-inch brake rotors. It also has four piston calipers in the back with 14-inch rotors. And while it's easy to make a car fast in a straight line, Porsche engineered the Cayenne to handle like a Porsche. These Cayennes in the GTS and Turbo models come standard with air suspension, which allows the car to really be a transformer and adjust its ride height. In addition, the Cayenne has actively adjusted suspension that is tuned to give you sporty handling. And better yet, the Cayenne even has amazing steering feel. It's really precise and responsive, and I love driving it. All right, so you're thinking, this all sounds great, but the Porsche Cayenne is still just a crossover designed for mall crawling and soccer moms. You'd be totally wrong, and that's the second reason why you should buy a Cayenne, because of its highly capable off-road performance. As I mentioned earlier, the Cayenne with air suspension is really a transformer. In the highest suspension setting, the Cayenne has nearly 11 inches of ground clearance, which is the same as a Jeep Wrangler. In addition, the first generation Cayenne, even by today's standards, has a fancy four-wheel drive system. It features a two-speed transfer case with a locking center differential as standard, and if you go with the Turbo S model, those came with active sway bars that can mimic disconnected sway bars to give you more wheel articulation. Additionally, the four-wheel drive system uses brakes to lock up wheels that are spinning and can redirect up to 100% of the engine's power to a single wheel. This is super, super helpful for off-roading as well as driving in the snow and ice. But wait, there's more. Here's an awesome feature you wouldn't expect a Porsche Cayenne to have. My Cayenne Turbo even comes with onboard air to inflate your tires. All you have to do is connect the inflation kit up to the air suspension via the port on the front passenger seat. Then you have air to inflate your tires. So how cool is that to have onboard air built into the car? I don't know about you, but I don't know of very many cars that have this feature. So all of these off-road features means the Cayenne can pretty much take you anywhere you and your family want to go and whatever adventures you want to throw at it. In my case, I use my Cayenne all the time to access various hiking and mountain biking trails. I even use it in the winter to go snowboarding, and I do this all on 21-inch wheels with all-season tires. How awesome is that? It just goes to show how much engineering and thought Porsche put into the Cayenne. The third reason you should buy a Porsche Cayenne is the styling. My Cayenne is 13 years old, but it looks great. It's still handsome, and I get plenty of compliments, and people really can't tell it's a 2008. Personally, I think the first generation Cayenne looks both sporty and rugged at the same time. The fourth reason you should buy a Porsche Cayenne is because of just how comfortable it is. Up front, you have plenty of legroom and headroom. You also have plush leather seats with memory on both the driver and the passenger side. In the rear, there's plenty of space for normal sized adults as well. The Cayenne's interior is also very luxurious, especially when you go with the full leather interior, which came standard on the Turbo and Turbo S models. You have leather pretty much covering all the important surfaces like the dashboard and the door cards. Moving over here, my Cayenne actually has the optional heated steering wheel, which is nice in the winter. And then as we look at the A-pillar over here, you have the beautiful Alcantara that goes all the way from the A-pillars up to the headliner, and that leads you up to either a standard or panoramic moonroof. Let me highlight a few more unique features. I really love that the driver and the passenger both have dual visors. Now you might think this is just a little thing, but when you're driving all the time and you're having to move your visor from the front to the side to block out the sun, it's just a little bit annoying. So I really, really have come to appreciate these. The Cayenne will also keep you and your passengers extremely comfortable. My Cayenne has the optional four zone climate control that allows the driver and the passengers to individually adjust the temperature fan speed and even the seat warmers for their corner of the car. So you can be assured that you and your passengers will not only arrive to your location in style but also in comfort. 
And lastly, the Cayenne has another party trick worth mentioning on the comfort side. It's got a refrigerated glove box so you can keep all of your snacks cold on your trips. How awesome is that? Moving on to the fifth reason you should buy a Cayenne, that's because of its utility. As I mentioned, the interior is roomy and can comfortably fit four adults. You also have a nice sized trunk to fit all of your gear for you and your passengers. And if you need more space, you can fold down the rear seats. I don't know exactly how much storage this opens up, but you can fit plenty of stuff back here. I'm also 5'8", and I can lay down all the way in the back here pretty much with no problem. So you do have a really big space for loading things. And if you made it this far in the video, you should now be convinced that the Cayenne is a proper, proper SUV. But if you're not, here's another feature that might change your mind. The Cayenne, even in the base trim, is rated to tow up to 7,700 pounds. You wanna to tow an Airstream, a boat, or another car, not a problem. So the Cayenne is an extremely proper and rugged and useful SUV. The sixth reason you should buy a Porsche Cayenne is because of its value. According to car gurus, used 955 and 957 Cayennes range anywhere from $7,000 to $15,000 on average. However, because these are just average prices, you do have to factor in another four or $5,000 for a turbo model. And if you want a GTS model, you're gonna have to pay a little bit more than that. But in my opinion, the GTS model is not even worth it versus a turbo or a turbo S. The Turbo and Turbo S comes with a lot more standard options and it has a lot more power. And of course, the price of a used Porsche Cayenne is going to be highly dependent on the condition and the mileage. However, you can find a well-maintained first-generation Cayenne Turbo with around 100,000 miles for $12,000 to $15,000 or so. And if you move up to the 957 Cayenne Turbos, you're looking at the $15,000 to $20,000 price range. All right, so we've made it to the seventh and final reason you should buy a Porsche Cayenne, and that's reliability. Now, now, before you go ahead and call me a hypocrite, if you've watched my videos, yes, you've seen that my Porsche Cayenne has had some reliability issues, but let me go ahead and explain. My Cayenne is 13 years old, and in its entire life, it's had about $12,000 done in unexpected repairs. Now, while the Cayenne isn't cheap to own and operate like it is a Lexus, it's by no means unreliable. These issues are well known, and most likely if you're buying a Porsche Cayenne with over 100,000 miles on it, and it's still running and it's in good shape, most likely the previous owner has gone ahead and addressed all of the known issues already. So things like the plastic coolant pipes and the drive shaft support bearing, most likely if you find a vehicle with over 100,000 miles, these issues have been addressed by the previous owner. And the good news is that once you address these common issues with the car, you don't have to address it again. So you can pretty much buy a used Porsche Cayenne at a really good price and most of these issues will have been addressed. And if not, you can just throw two or 3,000 and address all these issues and then you'll have a perfectly reliable car. Now there have been some reports of bore scoring and this is more common in cold climates. However, it still only has affected a small portion of Cayennes on the road. So overall, the Cayennes, regardless of what trim you go with, have pretty reliable engines and transmissions. Even the air suspension has been known to be extremely reliable. There is an issue with the air compressor seal going out and having to get replaced, but this is something you can do for about 100 bucks. While the Cayenne's reliability isn't as worry-free as a Toyota, it's very reliable given how over-engineered it is. If you do decide to buy a used Porsche Cayenne, look for one that has lots of maintenance records and get a really good pre-purchase inspection to make sure you know what you're getting into. And as I said earlier, if you can find a used Cayenne for a good price, it's not a big deal if not every single thing has been addressed on the car. These cars are so cheap that you can buy them, put two or $3,000 into them, and fix you know almost all of the issues on the car, and you'll have a very reliable rig that you can drive for years to come. All right, car fanatics, so that's why I love my Porsche Cayenne so much, and I think that these are one of the best used bargains on the market right now. I predict that they'll only grow in popularity, especially as people start to use these more as off-road vehicles and realize their potential. So definitely get one while they're still cheap. I really think that the Porsche Cayennes, especially the Turbos and the Turbo S's, are going to be extremely popular like FJ Cruisers and other vintage SUVs are today. So in 10 years, I think prices are gonna go up from here, so get them while you still can. Well, thanks for watching, Car Fanatics. For more Porsche content, check out www.ecarguides.com. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Be sure to hit that bell notification icon so you're notified each time I upload a new video. Thanks for watching.